I think it's important that um, the audio community and the networking community get together and talk hard about things that are important. Uh, there are quality of service issues for audio and video that are non-traditional in networking and there are a number of technical problems that can be resolved but need to be resolved carefully. Uh, I think it's great that uh, audio people and computer people can talk together and sort this out. The AES decided to get involved in standards in the early days simply to make digital audio work. Uh, digital audio needs some quite specific disciplines and unless you get things like sampling frequency correct, um, equipment can't work together, it can't interoperate. When we come to audio over networks, we have the same sort of problem, but now at a new level. Uh, and so, uh, two years ago, uh, working with our friends and colleagues in the EBU, uh, we started work on an interchange standard for audio streaming over networks. And late last year, we published a document called AES67, which is an audio streaming over IP network interoperability standard um, that should enable everybody who implements it to connect together in an open way and um, share streamed audio in much the way they would once have done using AES3 connections. I think there are some cultural differences. Um, uh, there are traditional IT, there's a traditional IT network culture and there's a traditional audio technology culture, and they don't always speak clearly to each other. Um, it's part of the job of standards to make that communication possible. Uh, sometimes the language needs to change, uh, sometimes the attitude needs to change, and this includes the attitude of the audio people. Um, but what we need to achieve at the end of the day, which is um, clean, stable, reliable, professional audio for broadcasting uh, or for installations uh, or for films is the same, no matter what the technology being used is. The professionals that we would like to communicate with are people specifying um, computer systems, and network systems and installations for um, applications where traditionally the uh, we would have used conventional, traditional cabling and wiring. Um, in the future, we think that broadcast stations and other installations will use cabling systems that look much more like IT and much less like a traditional TV station. Uh, but to get there, uh, we, need, we need help. Uh, we need good people to come up with good solutions. Uh, and my role in this is to help standardise the technologies that need to be standardised.